This is Mark Mandan Chamber EDC hosted its annual event called the State of the Cities. That's right. This is the opportunity for both cities to come together and talk about what's going on. Reporter Kaylin McLaughlin can tell us more about this year's meeting. Morning, Kaylin. Good morning, Josh and Alicia. Bismarck Mandan's EDC president went over what was on the agenda for this year's State of the City. Both city mayors were in attendance, so here are a couple of things they touched on. The State of the Cities is an annual event featuring Mayor Steve Bakken and Mayor Tim Helbling. It's when the two mayors come together to discuss what's happened in Bismarck and Mandan over the course of the last year. The two cities discuss economic growth, education, and workforce development. All this is to just share with our members, the business community, what's got, gone on in our community throughout the past year. This year, presidents of Bismarck State College, United Tribes Technical College, and the University of Mary are using this opportunity to unify our local college campuses. So Bismarck Mandan isn't often thought of as a college town, right? But the fact is that we do have three tremendous colleges and universities. The three college presidents welcomed business partners to on-campus event and spoke about enrollment. I have all three of those college presidents on stage talking about what's happening on their campuses, talking about their enrollments, and all the exciting things they contribute to Bismarck Mandan's economy. That's a big deal for us. The Bismarck Mandan Chamber has more than 1,300 members and is one of the most powerful business organizations in North Dakota. The purpose of the State of the Cities is to connect the business community with community leaders. That's what's so special, that's what's so important about today's event, is that opportunity to come together. This year, about 300 people were in attendance. For any additional information about the Chamber EDC, visit kxnet.com. Yeah, and uh, Kaylin Bismarck isn't typically thought of as a college mm -hmm. town, is that right? Right, and I'm used to being around so many colleges and universities. <laughs> it's, there's only three here, so I think yeah. it's really important for them to get together and kind of talk about for what's sure. going on. Yeah, yeah. just uh, see what's happening with the younger generation and uh, get them involved in the community. And so it'll be interesting to see how this all comes to fruition yeah. and all their discussions. Absolutely. All right, great story. Thank you, Kaylin.